Welcome to AmirAcademy.com and Quantity Survey Practice. Let us do the area of centering and structuring calculations so solving problem. Look at this example. Find the area of centering and structuring for a floor column, floor beam and floor slab. If the size of the column is 12 inch by 9 inch, the height of the ceiling is 10, uh, height of the ceiling is 10 feet. And and the slab thickness is six inch. Size of the beam along the horizontal axis is twelve inch by nine inch by one feet. Size of the beam along vertical axis is twelve inch by nine inch into by one feet. Look at this. This figure is given. Now let us solve the problem. Size of slab first. Here, yeah, this is a slab, rectangular slab is equal L equal 13.5 foot. Length is 13.5 foot and 13 point minus 2 times 9 inches minus 9 inches minus 9 inches look at here because the width is 9 inch here width of the beam is 9 inch both sides so subtracting that means which is equal 13.5 feet minus 9 inch is 9 inch by 9 inch is 18 inch which is equal 1.5 feet equal 12 feet depth is depth is 6 inches which is equal 0.5 foot therefore the size of the here Therefore, the beam length we calculate now, the beam length beam length equal, that is L equal 13.5 foot minus 9 inch minus 9 inch equal 12 foot now we we'll call play floor column first one here the floor column we have to do there are this is a floor column four columns of equal sizes centering and shutting area centering and centering and shutting area we calculate that one peripheral length that is L plus B into two L plus B that is a formula into depth into number of columns which is equal length is one four column length is one it is 0.75 4 into 2 times into number of column is 4 which is equal 140 that is here 1.75 1 into 3 is 10 also sorry here 
the depth is 10 into number of column is 4 which is equal here 1.75 into 2 is 3.5 into 10 into 4 which is equal 140 feet square. Four column shuttering is this much. 140 feet square. Now while doing shuttering column calculation for floor column, height of the floor column shall be considered up to ceiling height only. To ceiling height only. Given ceiling height is 10 feet here. Up to ceiling height. That is the total height we have to calculate. 9 plus 1, that is 10. Next, float beam along horizontal axis. Float beam along horizontal. Float beam along horizontal axis is equal Centering and shuttering area Centering and shuttering area or floor beam along horizontal axis That is equivalent to D. We are equal side area of beam side area of beam plus bottom area of beam into number of beams. into number of beams. This is equal Number of it, which is equal now L into there here now L equal 13.5 feet minus 9 inch minus 9 inch is equal 12, 12 feet. Now let us calculate. L into D into 2 plus L into B with number of columns. Number of columns is 4. L is 12, depth is 1 into 2 plus L is 12. It is so then 0.75 is total is multiplied number of columns 4 which having the population 66 it's cut now area of beam along horizontal axis now area of beam along vertical axis area of beam along vertical axis here L equal 14 feet minus 1 feet minus 1 feet equal to 12 feet now the same centering, centering and setting area is L into D into 2 plus L into B into number of columns is 4 equal 
12 into 1 into 2 plus 12 into 0 0.75 Here not from here horizontal here is two only here another two plus horizontal size. That is uh, L plus Twelve, sorry, twelve. Total equals sixty-six. Sixty-six feet square. Next, uh, four slab. Four slab. Four slab is peripheral length. Centering setting area is peripheral length L plus B. Four slab is uh, Four slab is peripheral length into depth plus beam area of the slab that is L plus B into two into depth D plus L into B is equal thirteen point five L plus B is thirteen point five. L is 13.5, B is 14 into 2, the is 0.5, which is equal for a plus L into B is 13.5. These are the areas for centering and shuttering for the given structure. So far we discussed about uh, area of centering and shuttering calculation for some structural part of the building. So here it is actually it is a four column with C simple population with four beams. We have done. Please subscribe our YouTube channel.